Some ANC branches will be disbanded, but only after an NEC meeting on the state of the organization in early September. Uh, the ANC lost the May elections dismally, and now its leaders are on a fact-finding mission to try and do some damage control before the local government elections come up in two years' time. Well, the acting ANC national spokesperson, Zuko Gudlimpi, says leaders will visit all ANC structures countrywide. We'll be meeting with the regional executive committee. We'll be meeting with ANC employees in government, at local government. Then we'll be meeting with branch structures of the ANC so that we can have a comprehensive understanding of the state of the organization in all the regions of KwaZulu-Natal. So the president is here, but the other officials are, are in other regions of the, of the province and the rest of the National Working Committee members are across the province to really ask the same set of, of questions. But of course, the problems of the ANC are not exclusive to KwaZulu-Natal. Even where we won in, in, the, in the May polls, we won on the basis of a, of a lower voter turnout, and there's just been a, a marginal decrease even in our strongest provinces. So we'll be visiting other provinces as well after Wazul Natal to really have the same sort of conversation. And as you are correctly say, the 2026 local government elections are around the corner. That is going to be our first test case. Are we going to do worse or better than we did in the, in the May polls? Our intention is to do better. We are talking to structures of the ANC so that if there are interventions to be made, they must be made on a rational basis, having listened to structures of the ANC, telling you about their understanding of their own organization on the ground. There's no arbitrary decision to dissolve this or that structure that is going to be taken. All interventions, including a dissolution, if it were to happen whenever, would be a product of a proper organizational assessment, not waking up in the morning and deciding that we are going to do this to this structure, we are going to do this to that structure. We are looking at a National Executive Committee meeting, which will be uh, convened at the end of August or early September, that will be dealing with the state of the organization comprehensively across the country, not just KwaZulu-Natal, and decisions will only be taken on the basis of that assessment.